No, oh, my face is Grizzly Adams again. Yee! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. So let's go out and about and flop around here. I never really showed you this place, did I? And girl here, get your game analyzed and fixed. So it's just basically, yeah, it's the golf clinic. And you can have them check over yourself. The pros teach here are really popular in the golf world. Your advice go stand on one open tea boxes. There's only one open tea box. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, trust me, if you want to be great, have the pros check your swing. You need to be more distance to be competitive in club tourneys. That's not true. Look at my scores. <laughs> bit longer, reduce your fade, and bit lower your... No, come on now, man. You're no pro. <laughs> your distance is better, but you're still drawing the ball a bit. Trick tree is high, too. Your hand high winds will... No, it'll help you stop the ball. Dang it. <laughs> few hints from the pros and I guarantee you'll see improvement in your ball's height in your ball's flight path honest well fine here you, you may evaluate my shot here all right so let's just give this a regular shot if I do a power shot I don't believe they'll count it oh that's perfect <laughs> but yeah if I so I'm not gonna do any power here I'm just gonna do a little top spin I guess I don't actually maybe that that'll disqualify their evaluation too I don't know well let's see here that's an amazing amount of top spin wow uh, yeah, okay, just hit normal shots. Thank you, and... Okay, fuck. You picky dogs, okay. <laughs> normal shots, and another one rough... Wow, right on the dots. It's very rare to hit it right on the dots like that, especially two or twice in a row, because the, the timing is just so tight. But okay, evaluate that one. It's advanced amateur distance. Oh, come on! <laughs> You got a nice straight shot, your trajectory is touch high, your impact zone is quite big, your control is pretty good, your spin power is strong. You still need a bit more distance. There. That shot is perfect. Wind doesn't affect your shots. Your, it, it actually does. It affects any shot, <laughs> regardless of the height. Your impact timing is slow, your ball takes a tiny turn, your stopping spin is good. And yeah, there really, really isn't much to do here other than to hear what they have to say about your stats. And, and that really is what it is, is, is your character st stats being evaluated. But your stats don't really mean all that much when you can shoot 17 under par on the Palms course. <laughs> anyway, any yeah, I should be... Oh, whoa, whoa, this is open! It's a good... It's too dirty to read. Okay, let's go in. <laughs> oh, it's a cuckoo course. It says here, cuckoo course, of course. <laughs> So this is uh, a course that has not been maintained for quite a while. So let's just take a look, see around. Hey, look at that! There's a little, little secret area to walk around in. Isn't that nice? Oh, cool. Oh, I'm done here. <laughs> but actually, wait. Couldn't I walk up through? No, I couldn't. I just wanted to see. But yeah, uh, I want to just want to go inside the house here. And this guy, he's in bed, not feeling too well. An age ago, this was a fabulously popular little golf course. Too bad it's overgrown with weeds now. As odd as it sounds, I believe that Grampy would heal if someone played a good round here. My beloved course is overgrown! My will to live fades as each green chokes on weeds! I have one last wish. Please, try it out and post fire better! Okay. <laughs> Oh, Grammy, this your fire banner is a very rare course, and records the post the fire banner! Oh, is that so? Oh, thank you! They're all excited now. <laughs> Hurry up now, give it a try! And... So since this course is overgrown, and the lies are horrible everywhere, that is the challenge of this one. And there's even out of bounds right behind the green there. So... <laughs> This is, anyway, the grass is long and the fairies are hard to see, but at least it's a par five. <laughs> it hasn't been manicured or groomed for an age, so it might be tough. Hang in there and par out. All right, here we go. So what you want to be aiming for, at least preferably, is the semi-rough spots. And there's not all that many spots around here that are semi-rough. And there might be trees in your way if you aim for the semi-rough. So I'm just gonna see how this goes right here and topspin it into it because I think it's gonna land a little short and just kind of go whoop, yep, just like that into the semi-rough. So you're never gonna get a fairway lie on this course, but you can get yourself into some decent position here. Uh, and do not go, as I said, out of bounds. All this orange 
a brownish, yellowish grass along the edge that kind of merges together is all out of bounds stuff. Oh, there we go. I found the shot. <laughs> I'll shoot to that semi rough over there. Hopefully. Uh, oh, 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 oh. I need to work with this a little better here. And hopefully I don't hit any trees. Oh, I hit a tree. Oh, I hit another tree. <laughs> Every <laughs> off. Okay, I can get out of this and still make par, hopefully. <laughs> and, 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 uh, take that, you monstrosity. <laughs> All right, 140 yards to the pin. All I need to do is get up and down for par now. Uh, that That's doable, but let, see, see, as I was saying, right, whoops. Right here, this is out of bounds, and it'll, you, as I said, if you go out of bounds, you'll be costed distance as well as uh, a stroke, so you definitely don't want that, especially since it's right next to the green. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna just try and control it with, uh, oh shoot, I shouldn't have used a three iron. Well, hopefully backspin will keep it under control. Oh shoot, well, I might have to redo this challenge, but we'll see, because you know, I can always chip it in. <laughs> That's always a possibility with me. And just give it a little top spin to roll it out. Oh no, no. Not quite. Well, I gave myself a hard start there. So, it's okay. I can redo it as many times as I like until I get it. As you've seen, I pretty much had it there even though I got myself in trouble. But oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. <laughs> no, it'll be just fine. It'll be <laughs> it's it's all about getting a good score to heal him. <laughs> Can I do it again, please? Oh, really? I ha I actually have to leave and then come back. That's is just unusually awkward. <laughs> uh, yes, <laughs> and there it goes. He he's healed again. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna give it give it my all here, like before. Can I just skip this? No, guess not. <laughs> just how to skip the cutscenes, because the cutscenes take longer than anything. Alright, par 5, yes, yes. At least I can tee it up on the first shot. <laughs> Alright, since it kind of worked for me before, I'm gonna hit over to here. Maybe, maybe, hopefully. I think I'm going to end up in the rough this time because I didn't hit it hard enough, but we'll see how it turns out. Oh, uh, oh, 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 it made it. Okay. So now I got to figure out my way around the trees again. You know, you know this drill here. And... and I definitely don't want to be out of bounds, so I don't want to be short in the slightest. Mm, how are these... How, look, what am I hitting... Ugh, I can't even tell on the 3D screen. How to go around that way? <laughs> where, where can I hit? Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, I could hit to that semi rough over there, probably. Like if I switch to a higher lofted club and yeah, go do something like that. Maybe, no, <laughs> this is such a this is such an awkward mini game, but it's so so much fun though. Um, if I if I don't get it, I'll hit in the water. So. This, uh, this could go badly. <laughs> nah, I got it this time. So, okay, that's that's an option that I can do. Oh, oh no! <laughs> trees, trees everywhere. Out of bounds, out of bounds everywhere. Um, I'm just gonna try and get as much out of this one as I can, I think. Uh, can I get, like, up over there? I think that'd be more... I No, that would be heavy rough, wouldn't it? Um... Uh, <laughs> can I hit under the trees with a lower lofted club? No. Well, I could, I suppose, hit there. I guess. That's not my most ideal position, because I want to be as close to the green as I can on my approach shot, but if that's how the, the dice roll, I guess that's how things are gonna go. Oh boy, four iron. Oh boy, five iron. That's not much better. <laughs> Actually, I think I'm gonna have to use the four iron and give it a rip. Uh, don't go out of bounds, please. Just safely sit on the green with super backspin, please. Oh, 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 yeah. Okay, 
Now I have a shot. Can I make par? I just move the smidge to the left. Yeah! Mini game complete! And the old guy, old groundskeeper, has been healed, probably! Because it was clearly just a broken heart. <laughs> um, uh, mm, hey, let's improve that. There we go. <laughs> excitement, excitement, the golfer, the skills of post fire, and the scores have finally come forward! Oh, glory! I'm not destined to meet the same fate as my course! Such joy! <laughs> yes, it's wonderful news, Grampy! <laughs> take it easy, okay? <laughs> I'll take nothing easy! Watching that rising star play with such fire has kept me all searchified! <laughs> Grampy, remember your bad back now, and your knees! <laughs> Grampy, we must find a way to thank this masterful young golfer somehow. Oh yes, you're absolutely right! Wait, I've got it! Dang, I'm smart! Oh my Grampy, you're going to give him... That! What is it? What is it? I can take you enough! Because of you, my will to live has come back in spades! I pay my debts, so I want to give a special present to you. Please, would you take it? Okay. I'm sure you'll come to treasure it. Now, where is that dang thing? It's around here somewhere. There she blows! <laughs> it's called a custom ticket. If you give this little butte to the custom club maker, it'll make a special club of your choice just for you. Trust me, it's well worth it. I'm sure this ticket will be better off with an upcoming coming golfer like you than an old hack like me. Oh, come on now. I've seen old people play good at any age. I mean, people play good at any age, I should say. So, it's not just old people. It doesn't really matter. I think Tiger Woods was shooting under par when he was like 10 years old or something. <laughs> hmm. That sounds awesome. I most certainly will. Got any more dialogue to. Yeah, it'll, it'll definitely take some cutting. <laughs> it's just back to give you the best of luck with that one. But uh, if you would like to, you could actually uh, replay this course. If you'd like to just by practicing it, but you won't be able to tee your ball up. Not that it really matters all that much, because you can still kind of get a good shot off the semi-rough. Because it's not like you're going to be hitting into the water or something like there or anything like that. But yeah, you can actually do that sort of thing. And yeah, anyway, back out to the field after that overblowing of excitement and... Thank Arceus, it's not open. Because I think you know what that place is if you've played the original Mario Golf. Anyway, Link's Chorus. Oh, I didn't actually read the sign here, did I? <laughs> I want to read signages. There we go! I have to be speaking to it diagonally. And I'll just do one more little side quest mini game type thing going on here. Link's Club Practice Center, pretty cool looking. You're hitting off of a mound here, and you can even read the sign here. Of course, it's a Link's Club Practice Center. They've got to re, got to do that twice. Of course, here's the putting green. Maybe I should do one of the putting challenges because those go relatively quickly. There's a little pathway over there, but I'll save that. Yeah, I would like to try that. 7 out of 10 putts, I will give that a shot. Alright, let's test my putting metal. I moved it a smidge to the left and hit it past the marker. One for one, that sounds good to me. I'm not going to move the cursor at all for that one. I'm just going to hit it a little past the marker. And bloop! Actually, I should have moved it a little bit to the right. But it still went in, so that's all that matters. It doesn't have to be a perfect putt. It just has to go in, which is... Good to me, this is a little more awkward. I put that pretty far to the right because of all the slope that I'm at to putt through. There we go. Or four. <laughs> just they're just draining left and right here. This is a long putt. I don't think I'll get this one. Oh, I got it. <laughs> well, there we go. Here's another long putt. I don't I don't think I'll get this one either, but who knows at this rate? I think this one's gonna be a little short. That's not a bad putt though from that range. Uh, I'm not going to move the cursor at all, I'm just going to hit a little past the mark because it's going to go up the hill near the end. Oh wow, really? It turned a little to the left? Surprising. And let's give it a good rip because there's a lot of slope here and... Oh, what the poop? 
I moved it to the right a little, but oof, now I gotta make all these putts. <laughs> I moved a smidge to the left, and hope for the best. <laughs> nope, I failed. That's too bad. Alright, start it again. It's a little smidge to the left. Yeah, this one's surprisingly difficult, despite there not being all that much slope to the green. That's okay, though. I can manage a little smidge to the left, because I remember that it didn't quite go... I mean, it didn't quite go in the center that other time. And this one's also gonna be a little smidge to the left. Oh, I hit that too hard. Well, better hit center! Ah! <laughs> yeah, if you don't hit the center when you're hitting it too hard, it's not gonna stay in the hole, and it's not gonna be affected by the break like you would expect. And I'll oh, shoot, pooper scoopers, this is much diff more difficult. <laughs> and like before, I don't expect to get this one in given the length and whatnot. Eh. Eh. You know what? Might as well start it over again. <laughs> Give myself the best chance as I go to repractice stuff. How did I do so good on my first run on this one? <laughs> okay, a little little smidgy. And a little past the marky. And... Oh! I, I must have barely moved it at all. I, I, I thought I'd seen it move, but maybe it was just... I don't know. Maybe it was just in my head when I... Because I thought I tapped it, but... You know, Xbox D-pad... Dang that putt! <laughs> I'm hitting from the same uh, places each time. You know, for each run, but... It's not... Really a, a super... Perfection game, I guess you could say. So it's kind of hard to feel out where I'm, I should be hitting exactly on the meter and where I should be aiming on the ah, <laughs> where I should be aiming on the green especially from such distances so yeah this is actually a lot harder than I remember it can it go in oh oh oh, oh. <laughs> ah, I started over <laughs> and come on now just trying to make some putts here now this one this one here, I'm not gonna move the cursor, but I'm gonna hit harder than the mark. Like, two notches harder than the mark and see how it goes. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with that. Because it seems more consistent, and every time I move it on this one, I miss. So I'm not gonna move it, and you're gonna see... Yeah, okay. So, three for three. And this one, this one's a little side hilly. It's also a little up hilly. And, okay, I got that. Getting the hang of this now. And I think that's enough power, hopefully. Uh, yeah, now this is looking a lot better for a run. Now I just gotta make a couple more of these putts here. It goes uphill quite a bit. So I hit a couple not... No, not enough. Uh, not enough. Um, I'm not gonna move the cursor here. It looks like it's going straight across the, the marks. No, they weren't. So I gotta move that one right. <laughs> Uh, poopers, scoopers. Oh wait, this one was the one that tricked me. I, I was supposed to hit that, this one straight, because it looked like it was going over a side hill a little bit, but... Hmm, I don't know how to, re how to read that one. <laughs> In all honesty. Okay, I moved that one a little bit to the right, because I ended up left on that one on the other time. Ah, oh, dang it! <laughs> well, looks like I'm restarting again! <laughs> Come on now. A little smidge to the left. A little past the mark. And in it goes. See, so I got that one. Not moving it. Gonna go a notch or two past the mark. And she goes in. Number three, don't move it again. One or two past the mark. She goes in. <laughs> See, you'll eventually get it, in theory. Just a matter of replays and learning how the brakes feel out. I mean, feel out the brakes on your putt. Um, and, and a little smidge to the left, a little bit past the mark, because it's uphill, and... no. Oh, well, I still got other putts to make here, and I'm still learning them, so... I still have a chance at being able to make some of these longer ones here. Uh, <laughs> what a tease! Okay, so this one ended up a smidge to the right, right? So I moved it a little bit to the left. And it misses left. What is that putt's deal? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, move that. Oh, wait, actually, I'm gonna move it a little to the left this time, actually. Because something is messing with me on this putt. Oh, yeah, you actually have to move that one left. That's surprising. And okay. 
And move that a little to the right. A little past the mark. And nope, not enough right. But at least I've read that one correctly. <laughs> Restarts! I'm just going! Ah! Well, I gotta make this last putt, which I actually haven't practiced because I've always quit the minigame before I got here. Uh, that's pretty far uphill, so I'm actually gonna have to change this. This doesn't look good here. <laughs> uh, I, think uh, I think it's gonna move left and back right, so I'm just gonna leave it centered and see how it goes. Hitting past the mark slightly. Okay, so it's, it's gonna miss left. Ah, poopers. Well. Alas, alas, looks like I'm gonna have to re retry the mini game from the overworld, okay? <laughs> you know, you know what I should do? I should try and get those first couple of putts all in a row, because I, that, I, because I, at least I understand these putts. And then maybe I'll get lucky on the remaining ones, perhaps, maybe. And, well. Mmm. Ah! <laughs> mmm. Well, I still have a chance, so. So, uh, this one was left. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wanted to cancel by pressing B, a la Mario Golf Game Boy Color style, but ah, yeah. <laughs> All right, come on now, come on now. There we go. <laughs> I've done it before, and I can do it again. Come on, yeah. Getting the hang of these, for sure. A little past the mark so I don't <laughs> pop it back at me. Uh-huh. little smidge to the right. A little... Oh, shoot, that's too hard, isn't it? Well, yeah, it is too hard. Mmm! Ah! Mm. <laughs> uh, I move it a little left. In it goes! And... A little more left. A little harder than I've been hitting it. And, oh, in that one goes. Okay, this is looking like a promising run. Okay, moved it a little to the right, because I seem to be ending up left. And, yeah, there we go. And now this one was a smidge to the right. A little past the mark. And, and, come on, come on, come on. Yes! There's it! There it goes, finally! Seven out of eight. But how many more can I make? We'll see. Not that one, though. Nope, nope, nope. And, and, and... Oh shoot, wait, I had to move this to the right. Switch to the long putts. And hope for the best. Because the long putt's really finicky. And... Ooh, that was pretty good for a long putt. But I got it. <laughs> Alright. And I'll go for straightening of shots. There we go. And of course, I unlock another hole. I also got a star on my side quest thing, a jigger and whatnot. But wow, that took a lot, lot, lot longer than I thought it was going to. I might even actually put some cuts into that. But for now, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part.